Hello, welcome back to my channel, Cassie's Gaming. Today I'm playing Marble Guardians of the Galaxy, and please subscribe, and let's play. They got Flark and Faith batteries everywhere. Just like on Hal's Hope. Perhaps they have built another giant ray gun inside the Continuum Cortex. To siphon Faith from multiple worlds at once? Hey! Check it out! We got bad guys! They do not fear death! batteries the deeper we go. Hundred units says they're tied to the fulfillment. Priest said that they were bringing... They can't raise the dead, especially after we saved Nikki. Over here! Looks like we can squeeze through. We must be close to Mantlo's bar. Can you see it? There is no way through this wall. Could be a bunch of wackos just waiting for us on the other side. Good point. Peter, you should find a way over to check. What? Why me? Ain't you the leader of this outfit? <laughs> I could pull, I could that, pull chunk that chunk out. out. I've been thinking about what Warlock said. Well, that didn't work. I'm going in. What about the fanatics? I'll toast them if I see them. We're the only ones who can do this, right? Clear back here, Quill. Looks like you're gonna have to yank a chunk free from this side, though. Gamora, you should be able to get your sword in there now. Give me a boost. Oh, Scott! Not Mantlos. Look at her. This is personal. Huh. What's taking so long? I know how much you love this dive. It was the one spot in this whole Flarkin galaxy where a guy could feel safe. I mean, except for the bar brawls, and the security raids, and the bounty hunters. We'll drink to it later. Right now, we've got to keep moving. I don't suppose we could try tricking them again? Make them believe we're all promised up? Not unless you can fake that purple glow they all seem to have. There has been no sign of Goldie Braun since he left from our ship. Adam Warlock. He might be splattered somewhere across the lower city. Or got picked up by a wandering creep squad. Or maybe he was lying about which side he was on and was just waiting to attack us. The Warlock carries an old grudge. He would not align himself with the Grand Unifier. Yeah, what do we need the Golden Boy for anyways? We were doing fine without him. I was not fine. Magus was devouring my soul. Your memory is suspect. My memory is flawless. I'm just an awkward. Danger lies ahead. We must get ready. Looks like the church is trying to keep us out of there. That's not gonna work. Careful, Peter Quill. Guys, look down. It's an awful lot of light. You're thinking it's the full Flarkman, ain't you? But it could just be runoff from the cables. Whatever these whack jobs are up to, they need a lot of juice. Perhaps this is how they powered their fleet to reach Lamentus. Nah, the Cortex could handle that on its own. Nikki had Warlock's Soul Stone in her hand. What if it's fused there and Raker's trying to remove it? <laughs> like he did with Goldilocks? Didn't work all that well the first time. The girl may have sensed the evil in the stone and insisted they try again. Or she's outlived her usefulness and Raker wants the stone's power for himself. Our level of cooperation is invigorating. We have become a formidable team. Yep, sure have, Drax. Ain't we just one big, happy Flarkin family? What are you doing with that garbage? She's not garbage. Behold the power of the light! 
Definitely not good. Gamora, wait, hold on a sec. Why? Some more children can be sacrificed in the name of Rager's flarked up church. Oh, of course not. Just just what, Peter? I don't know. We every minute we waste. We don't have time to breathe. I know Raker brings back bad memories. This isn't about Thanos. It's about Nikki. And what men like Raker and Thanos do to girls like her. Like me. My sister. If I had just been better at protecting Nebula, maybe... Maybe she wouldn't be dead. Whoa. What? Nebula's dead? How? By who? Tell me, so I can find him and shake his protected hand. By me. You killed your sister? She is the one you saw in the Matriarch's promise. That's how I knew it was a lie. The nebula I knew had been twisted into a hateful, vengeful monster thing. One who would never stop unless I stopped her. So I did. I just never expected to survive. Why didn't you say something? It's not exactly a conversation starter. Hi, I'm Gamora. I murdered my sister. Can we be friends? Of course we can. 
How can you be friends with a monster? Why would you want that on your team? A team I actually kind of enjoyed being on, all things considered. Well, uh, I hate Nebula, so I actually would have. What? I'm just saying it don't change nothing. Actually, it changes everything. The most deadly woman in the galaxy just admitted she loves us. I did not. You did? You said you were in love with us right after the part about killing your sister. I said I enjoyed your company. That is the Katathian definition of love. Like. I I'll give you like. C can we just move on? Agreed. That's about all the love fest I could take. We accept you, Gamora Zenbury. Pretty sure we're married now. This is excruciating. All right, I'm pretty sure we've all caught our breath. What say we go stop a nut job cult leader? Yes. Assassin is in trouble! Keep inventing this thing! 